Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video, where um, before we get started, I'm going to ask that you hit that like, comment, subscribe button, notification bell, and all that good stuff. But, ew, excuse me, just burped into the microphone. This rude code. Rude. Um, before I go too far, I do want to show you something. Um, where is it? Right there, is that it? Google Chrome? Yeah, that's it. Okay. So for those of you who did not know, I um, write articles for PC Magazine. So here's my page. Link will be in the description down below, and it's going to be one of the default descriptions that comes up on every video from this point forward. And I thought I'd better show this to you guys um, just in case. I write articles for PC Magazine, so I've done Roblox 101, how to create custom meshes, Roblox 101, how to pick up, uh, pick a Roblox premium plan, Roblox 101, how to avoid uh, free Robux scams, Roblox 101, how to make real money from your video games, Roblox 101, Roblox 101, how to make your first game, and I'm still writing more articles, but I thought that might be imperative to let you know because. Um, I have an interview coming up where I'm actually going to be on one of their podcast um, news station thingies. Anyhow, um, I'm going to be um, doing an interview just on my knowledge of Roblox and, and development and stuff like that. Uh, and I wrote three books. Um, well, I wrote one book and then I've revised the first book of the series and I've updated my book. So. Again, links are all in the description down below. But I want to um, continue playing and building on my base. And it makes me super sad. It makes me sad that I did that awesome uh, admin control panel and it got barely any views. You guys don't care about the dev stuff. You're here for lumber. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna build inside lumber. But here's the thing, I am building on solo. And uh, a lot of people have been coming to me and being like, Code, I want to play with you. Code, I want to do collaboration. Code, I hate to say this. I don't want to play with anybody. I want to play solos, you know, or go off and, and play a game with my kids, something collaborative with my kids, you know. They're getting up there in age. Uh, Hope's got six months and she's going to be driving. That's crazy to me. Uh, I'm getting up there in age. Ollie. You know, he's three years, two years away from, from high school. He's already almost as tall as I am. He's taller than his mom, taller than his sister. He's the tallest kid in his class. And it just, it reminds me of how short time actually is. Now, it, it didn't really take that long, but I've been alive for 40 years. And I, I'm supposed to have like a midlife crisis or something like that where... I, I freak out and like go buy a motorcycle. I, I, I don't know what the case is, but I do recognize that time travels fastly, fast. Time, time goes by really fast. And a lot of you kids are going to be sitting there going, it, does, it takes forever to get through school. It, why does it take so long? Blah, blah, blah. Trust me. If you're in school right now, enjoy it. Enjoy every minute of it. Do not grow up too quickly. Because you, you will quickly find that once you have to spend your own money on uh, groceries, you'll realize that you do have food in the fridge, just like your mom said. <laughs> we have food in the fridge at home. Anyhow, um, it's, it's happening. The times are changing and People are growing and just, it's good. It's a good state to be in. Oh, that is the wrong direction, isn't it? Rotate, rotate. Um, even looking at like all the people that I have met along the way of my Roblox path, you know? I've had a lot of friends come and go, a lot of people who uh, are no longer around or have like changed and done something different. And there's been a lot of staff and a lot of admins, a lot of people in my Discord who have come and gone. And for those of you who are still watching my videos, um, who are part of my previous staff, thank you. Thank you for all the hard work and dedication and everything that you've done. I just, I don't know, I'm feeling very sentimental today. 
and a little sad because of that other video, but that's neither here nor there. <clears throat> um, it did get brought up by casual content that uh, he asked, why don't I have a star code? And I figured it's probably time that I told the story. Let you guys all know basically the, the rundown of how it all happened. The star program was in its infancy. Like it was just conceived, just brought up. And at the time, there weren't really any requirements for it. Like it was, it was new. And I was trying to get in, trying to get in. I kept messaging uh, the, the person that was in charge of it. It was Terraris or something like that. And nobody was responding to me. Nobody responded. And I tried for nine months to get in. Nine months before they, the, the new guy. Oh gosh, what's his name? It's John. I think it's John. He got in there and... Um, started taking over and they came up with this rule that you have to have like a hundred thousand subscribers um good standing in the community so many subs on on youtube stuff like that and it just came to my attention that one of the requirements is you have to have a minimum of twenty five thousand views per video i don't have that and i know i don't have that because you know what i don't edit i don't do the normal YouTube stuff. So you know what? I'm not really an asset to their idea of what a star program should be. And I've been rejected. I've been rejected so many times. Even after the requirements of 25,000, I, I kept putting in and putting in and putting in. In fact, um, after I got done speaking with casual content, I put it in again because I don't feel like that particular thing, 25,000 views per video. I mean, maybe if I had like a million subs, but. Uh, my content's just not that type of YouTube content. You know, it, it's very different from the normal review Roblox, Roblox dramas, um, quickly run through a game and use Robux to like spend everything and to get like a billion pets. It's just different and I don't know, I don't know how to change it. I mean, I've tried different things. I've tried different Roblox games. You guys don't watch them. I've tried uh, doing the development thing. You guys don't watch them. It's just different. I'm known for, for lumber and I like lumber. So I would rather have people asking, why doesn't code have a star code? Rather than people looking at the stats and going, why does code have a star code? I, I would rather have that. In all honesty, I'll keep trying. I mean, I won't ever stop sending them emails. Like, hey, I would like to be considered for the star program, please. I just hope they take into consideration like the, the PC magazine articles and the, the live streams and all the stuff that I've done in the past, you know, the books, I mean, come on. <sighs> I don't know if famous birthdays counts for anything, but you know what? I'm on there too. Hey, and at least I got, I still have my creator code for, uh, for, um, Fortnite, you know, hope I don't lose that. I haven't streamed Fortnite in a while. I should go and do a Fortnite video just for the uh, the new weather system because there's there's a new weather system that came out today. Do you guys want to see some Fortnite? I mean, I'll probably release a Fortnite video and you guys won't even watch it, but that's fine because that's what I want to go and do. Uh, and then I also have my other channel, which is Zero Decaf Coffee. <coughs> I finished the uh, Resident Evil series. It's still over there. Um, public service announcement. It is not family friendly. They will have uh, curses in the game. Same awesome YouTuber, unfiltered content. So, but I mean, that'd be the same thing as me being like, oh yeah, PewDiePie or Markiplier. And you guys know who they are. And Parents don't restrict that stuff either, do they? Hmm. Shouldn't be on the internet if you're 
under the age of 13. Oh, Code, you just like demolished half of your viewership. Yeah, probably, but that's fine. I think if you are educated enough to understand how the internet works, like if your parents come to you and say, hey, this is what the internet is, and they educate you about what to look out for, what's out there, then I don't think it's bad. I think it's a great learning tool, and I think um, a lot of people have this expectation of what companies should do for their, uh, their games and stuff, as far as being family friendly. For example, with Roblox, all right? I will tell you this right now. Roblox, even though it looks like a kid's game, it is not, it, it is not. <laughs> there are a lot of things in here that if you don't understand what memes are, if you don't understand uh, the basic concepts of like how trolls work, what to avoid, stuff like that, it can be a very dangerous place. And um, there was an article that somebody had written saying that Roblox is a child labor factory. No. No. I will disagree. Uh, there was one article that, or there was one video that Dieter Plays had commented on and gone into details with. And I think Dieter went too far the other way. Because there were some good things to take away from the uh, the video, but I do agree they're not going to control. It, it, that would be like Microsoft coming in and controlling everything that's on the App Store and saying you can't do certain things. Oh wait, that's kind of what they do, isn't it? <laughs> Bad example. Come on, move. I'll have to think of a better example later. I think I just finished my roof while I was talking. Did I just finish my roof? Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so we can do the correlated walls, corrugated, corrugated, corrugated walls, corrugated, 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 short fence. No, it's these things. Wasn't there a larger one at one time? It's a fence, short fence. Is that the only wall that we have? Oh gosh. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. I need to look at the design real quick. If it's wrong, I'm gonna be wrong. Is that right? Hold on. How did how did we do this one? Let's let's move this one. Move. Okay. So we do need to come like one more over and rotate it. So let's move. Rotate, rotate. We'll go one more over. Come on. Get on top. Get up there. There we go. And then let's just go right across. Hold on. I need to Need to move that out the way. Okay. Do that wall again. Where is it? There we go. Wow. Why is that so hard to place? And then I kind of want to like a little window right here. So there should be a, a short corrugated wall out. Short corrugated. Come on, come on. Like that. I don't want it to be too long. I mean, that would work. Right? There we go. That, that'll look cool. And then, corrugated wall. Right. Come on. Can I stare at it? Oh, what, what? What? I am building only on my land. Sir? System? Oh, dang it. I 
enough. Hold on. Oh, I can't use that to get up there. Ah, oh, dang it. We're gonna need cherry wood. Hmm. Do I have any cherry wood laying around? I do not. So. Anyhow, what was I talking about? Um, completely forgot. Went right out my brain. But I'm also a little bit tired. Um, I have been running out of time because I've been doing uh, P90X and exercise and keto. And, oh, it is wearing me out. I'm an old man. Maybe not as old as people think, but it's fine. Can we do this? Uh, you might be asking, hey, Code, why did you give up on this stuff over here? Well, first off, because I don't think it can be done. Wow, that was loud. I don't think it can be done. Um, I will try different methods. Mangry, I'm sorry. One wing Mangry Gamer was like, Oh, did you ever get this figured out? I'm like, well, I was close, but was not able to figure it out. Oh, there's a cherry tree right there. That should be enough, right? We're gonna need to chop, chop, choppity chop. Now, if I remember right, I should. Lower that down. Should be able to do this. Stay on, buddy. Stay on. Nope. Fell down. I was like, I can get this whole tree in one swoop. This is gonna be awesome. Stay. Oh. Okay. Maybe if we flip, can we flip? I don't think we can flip a cherry tree. I know we can flip oak trees. Pew. Oh yeah, we can flip. That's awesome. Whee! I'll just run. I'll just run it in. <laughs> That's how you do it. You just ram into it and hope it gets there. Oh oh. Flip. Oh, 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 come on, come on. Flip. Ow, 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 ow. Flip. And right down that way, sir. That should be good. <sighs> motivation. I need to give you guys motivation for the day. Because if you're at lunch right now and you're watching this on your lunch break, um, first off, I hope you enjoy your lunch, but maybe you had a bad morning, or maybe you had a bad day at school, or maybe the boss yelled at you while you were at work, whatever the case may be. Know that you're going to have bad days, but you're also going to have good days. Now, that doesn't mean live in a perpetual state of happiness, because happiness is nothing more than a state of being, just like being sad. And it is unhealthy to stay in constantly. So. <clears throat> that doesn't mean go out and be a bad person. That doesn't mean, like, try to make everybody else's day miserable. What it means is a lot of people, you ask them, what do you want out of life? And they're like, happiness. That's the wrong answer. Because, again, it's a state of being. Yeah, you're going to be happy. 
You're going to have moments of happiness, even if you have a horrible, horrible day. You'll still find little moments of happiness, you know? And if you have a sad day, maybe you have some happy in there somewhere. And it's okay. It's okay to have a bad day. In fact, it's healthy. It's also healthy if you have an argument with someone and or, or a fight or a situation and you go back and you replay that in your mind and you think to yourself, I could have done this differently. I should have said that. Uh, the comebacks that you could have said, you know, it is perfectly normal for you to do that. It's, it's part of our id. There's a term in psychology. I don't remember what it's called, but everybody does that. So don't think that you're the only one. All right. And I know a lot of people, like if I were to say, Charles, you, Charles. Now there's going to be a certain percentage of people out there whose name is Charles and, or Chuck or Charlie, you know, and they're going to freak out and be like, Oh, he's talking about me. No. I'm not. I am going off of just a random name. Susan. Earl. Candace. Abby. Brent. What I'm saying is all the emotions, all the things that you feel every day in life, everybody else in the world, they have those same emotions, feelings, Thoughts of insecurity, just like you do. And it should be very humbling to think you're just like me. There's days that I, I fear coming on here and recording anything. I'm like, oh, I'm not going to have any ideas. People aren't going to like what I do. People are going to make fun of me in the comments. It happens. And this is, this is for all YouTubers, big and small. Creek, I know Creek has the same feelings of insecurities, of fears that everybody else does. You know, my username is this. He's going through some big stink right now. And I'm not going to bring up the controversy because that's not the point. My username is this. Started over here. He started in Lumber Tycoon 2. In fact, he was a big fan of mine. <laughs> He's. I hope still a big fan. Um, he created a pixel art of my face, of my logo, on his base. In fact, he was the first person I was calling Hoover for a long time because he was kind of a Hoover troll, creating the uh, tree cannon and exploding all over the place. So, I knew a lot of these guys growing up. Uh, Intel Plays, who is now Row Builder, dude. You showed up on my, my For You page, my, my recommended page, which was crazy. I'm like, wait a second, I know him. <laughs> so it's a, it's a good deal. It's, it really is. It's just so good. You know what we need? We need ladders. And that's what I'm going to do. Um, hold on. Let's get, let's get out of there. Out. Ladder. All right, we're going to put a ladder here. Ladder here. Ladder here. Somewhere. Now I know Electra is going to be looking at me and going, Code, you know you can separate them out by individual spaces, blah, blah, blah. I know. I know I could. I don't want to. I'm doing this. I'm doing me. I'm doing my thing. Maybe, if I can get close enough. <sighs> I like the building system on here. Uh, I kind of wish the uh, test two building system was on here. Ow. Always thought it was a little bit more stable. Or a little bit more functional. What's the word for diverse? It was a lot more diverse. Oh gosh. 
Up we go. Okay. Maybe I need to not be in first person. There we go. Oh gosh, now I can't see anything. Sweet. That's how you build the walls. Uh, should I probably worry about the the floor in here? Or the ceiling, rather? Seems kind of small. Um, tell you what, let's do that. Let's throw in some floors here. Oh, are these going to fit? I didn't even think about this. Oh yeah, they'll fit. They'll fit. Good deal. Wait, that looks tiny. Oh gosh. I don't like that at all. Destroy. Destroy. Let's go with the large tiles. And do the tiles fit towards the top? They do. Which will give us more room. Dang it. I missed. Should feel like more room towards the bottom. Of course, that's going to throw off all the other builds up above it. Dang it. Okay. So, move, turn, turn. There we go. We want it to be even with the next floor. Move. Come on. Come on. Can we somehow just it's not going code right now. Oh, and that's not going to fit because it's going to be above there. Hmm. I'm going to have to do some crazy artwork with that. Hmm. Maybe we should just go one up above. Hold on. How does this floor go in? Okay. Maybe we should do that. So like, instead of doing this craziness, just come all the way over to the side. Yeah, let's do that. That way we can just worry about the entire floor at one time. No, you worry about yourself. There we go. That way we don't have to worry about the design pattern there. That'll be good. Oh, and that's not going to fit, is it? Is it going to fit? Not going to fit. It's going to be one unit off. Dang. Probably should have done that before I did the roof. Well, too late now. Oh, come on. There we go. I don't want it to be a unit down. I want it to be straight across, please. Please. Oh gosh. We're gonna need some lights in here soon. You can always tell when I start concentrating on the build because uh, I'll stop talking. <laughs> Code, stop talking? What? It never happens. He's constantly talking. Can't get him to shut up. I know. There's one. I think that's also part of my part of my spiel, part of my channel is that constant talk. Which I think is a good thing. I think talking in general is a good thing. You know, communication. Which is the way it should be, I think. No. Down one, down one. Come on. Come on. Get in there. There it goes. And that is, that is hard to line up. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I did not realize the time. Do you guys see what time it is? It's like 29 minutes in. I'm going to have to redo this uh, 
this wall over here. Come on, please. Just line up. <sighs> Got it. And there we go. Okay, that's going to be all that I can place for now without going crazy. And is this walnut? This is walnut. So I will need to take walnut up there to do the floors. Because I'm going to stick with the walnut floor. So let's go do one tile real quick. Boom. Maybe maybe we'll do a second one. That way I can actually take the uh, the wood up there to chop it. Come on. Ah, oh, no. We hit the 30 minute mark. Dang it. So close. I am including the couple of seconds that it takes for my intro to play. Oh, that's going to look lovely. That's, ah, that is awesome looking. If you're in first person, like a VR or something like that, dude, what a house. Take you on a house tour someday. All right, that's it. I'm out. <clears throat> Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Um, by the way, I did say that I've got the Golden Gamer headphones from Twitch, right? These headphones, a lot of people ask about them. You can't buy these. These have to be given to you by Roblox. So that's, that's something amazing. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do those cool things I'm supposed to call out. All your choice. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. I'm going to go play some Fortnite. <sighs> Outro.